Travelling back in time isn't necessarily science fiction. However, most scientists see time travel as pure fiction. But mathematically, it is possible. Scientists for years have discussed whether it is possible for us to time travel forwards or backwards in time and the possible ways that can be done, either by the scientific knowledge that we now have or by scientific hypothesis. The scientific language used to explain the various time travel theories can be quite mind-boggling and the following are five theories that try to explain how time travel could be possible. Number five, wormholes. Wormholes are tunnel-like connections made out of space-time, offering a shorter distance between two vastly separated areas of the universe. As the universe can bend and contort, it can also, in theory, fold up on itself, like taking a sheet of paper and folding it. If we could fold space in the same way, we would not just be bending space, but bending space-time. Physicist and cosmologist Paul Davis from the University of Arizona believes if a wormhole could exist and could be traversable, then it would be a means of going back in time. The idea is that space travellers can use these tunnels to make space-time commutes. In the film Interstellar, a band of astronauts travel through a newly discovered wormhole connecting widely separated areas of space-time. Number 4. The Tipler Cylinder the Tipler cylinder is a cylinder of dense matter and infinite length, spinning at high speed around its long axis and enabling time travel. If you walk around the cylinder in a spiral path in one direction, you can move back in time, and if you walk in the opposite direction, you can move forward in time. The rotation creates a frame-dragging effect and fields of closed time-like curves traversable in a way to achieve time travel. This solution to Einstein's equations of general relativity is known as the Tipler cylinder. Tipler suggests that a finite cylinder may accomplish the same effect if its speed of rotation increases significantly. Tipler's original solution involved the cylinder of infinite length, and Tipler suggested that a finite cylinder might produce closed time-like curves if the rotation rate were fast enough. Maybe Doctor Who's spinning TARDIS could be seen as a type of Tipler cylinder. 3. Speed of Light Travelling at close to the speed of light would theoretically allow time travel into the future. As time slows down for the speeding object in order to protect the cosmic speed limit of the speed of light. If it were possible to exceed the speed of light, then it would also be possible to go back in time. Time dilation would make it possible for passengers in a fast-moving vehicle to advance further into the future in a short period of their own time. One year of travel might correspond to 10 years on Earth, and a constant 1G acceleration would permit humans to travel through the entire universe in one human lifetime. Space travellers could then return to Earth billions of years into the future. That is, if there were an Earth to come back to. Number 2. Gravitational Waves Physicists working with a powerful observatory detected ripples in space and time created by two colliding black holes, confirming a prediction made by Albert Einstein 100 years ago. These ripples in the fabric of space-time were called gravitational waves and were created by the merger of two massive black holes 1.3 billion years ago. Imagine that space-time is a fabric that stretches through the universe and is affected by matter like stars, black holes, planets and other cosmic objects. Massive bodies warp space-time around them, creating what we now know on Earth as gravity. Maybe if scientists could learn more about it, it could possibly lead to some kind of understanding of how to manipulate space-time to potentially travel through time. Number 1. Cosmic Strings Another theory for potential time travellers involves something called cosmic strings, which are narrow tubes of energy stretched across the entire length of the ever-expanding universe. Cosmic strings are a hypothetical topological defect in the fabric of space-time left over from the formation of the universe. Interaction could create fields of closed time-like curves, permitting backwards time travel. These thin regions, left over from the early cosmos, are predicted to contain huge amounts of mass and therefore could warp the space-time around them. Cosmic strings are either infinite or they're in loops with no ends, scientists say. The approach of two such strings parallel to each other would bend space-time so vigorously and in such a particular configuration 
that might make time travel possible, in theory. Some scientists have suggested using cosmic strings to construct a time machine. By maneuvering two cosmic strings close together, it is theoretically possible to create an array of closed time-like curves. By firing two infinitely long cosmic strings past each other at very high speeds, you could fly your ship around them in a carefully calculated figure eight loop and in theory be able to emerge anywhere, anytime. Got that?